I was just thinking about my grandma today. Rest in peace, Lao Pa. I remember her saying that never mix honey with tofu. So it looks like somebody asked the same question on Reddit. Will eating honey with tofu kill you? My mother just dropped this one on me when I was putting honey on my tofu. If so, how? So today we're gonna test out that theory. If it's actually harmful or deadly, mixing tofu with honey. So many different kind of tofu. All right, so I just got back shopping from 99 Ranch Market. I picked up the House Foods Premium Tofu. Looked for the soft. It doesn't matter if you whether you pick soft, medium, or firm. This experiment will work regardless. And a quick shout out to House Foods. And also a quick shout out to Private Selection, raw and unfiltered clover honey. So let's go ahead and open up the package and cut a big slice of Make a cut a big cube of the tofu. <sighs> Gotta represent this science experiment properly so this doesn't end up on Snopes. <laughs> Alright, look at this, how beautiful this tofu is. I'm gonna cut out this big piece right here. How about that? Yes, sir. Here we go. Nice big chunk right here. I have my Apple iPhone 7 timer. Get ready to set. Let's go ahead and just dump this honey on here. And let's see if it solidifies. Nice drainers from mine right here. Oh, I've got to show you the texture first. Let's see how I can just stick, stick it in here. We want to see and wait how long it gets to solidify. So it's been well over an hour. Let me check on it. I can tell it's a little bit, a lot more firmer than the regular tofu. But I think it's because, notice how that turn it watery, the mixture. I think I need a little piece to be submerged inside the honey. So I'm just gonna scoop a little tiny piece right here. All right. And then I'm gonna put it in this shot glass. And I'm gonna submerge it in the honey. And we'll check back a bit. All right, guys, it's been over two hours. It looks like one is a big chunk like this without being submerged in the honey. It's uh, barely noticeable, but let's go ahead and pour this out. It looks like jello right here. Right, let's pour this out. Oh my goodness. Wow. Look at how dense that is. So let's poke this with a new chopstick, guys. Oh my goodness. It is, it is quite hard, guys. It is quite hard. Alright, so tofu has calcium sulfate, which acts as a plaster when you mix in with the honey. So the sugar and that plaster solidifies or coagulates together similar to how concrete works. So if I cut a piece of a regular tofu, it cuts off easy like that. See how that goes smooth like butter? 
Now, if I try to um, cut that, it's a little bit more rigid. So you just imagine if that was like a lot of these were stuck in your intestines or down your throat, how that can be an issue. That can make you, uh, that can block your, uh, block your throat, which can cause a lack of oxygen, also your intestines. And I'm pretty sure that's gonna be hard to digest. Look at that. See how that just becomes uh, like mush. So I'm gonna try to do this right here. No, it goes to uh, pieces. I'm telling you, this is like like gelatin. It becomes gelatin, like versus uh, your regular soft tofu. Wow. So I hope you guys enjoyed this science experiment. Make sure you click on the subscribe button for more exciting videos. Be careful, sometimes mixing the wrong type of food can be harmful or dangerous to the body. Take care of yourselves.